Psalm 44, verse number uh, 24. He say, he say, he says, he says, he says, he says, Why do you hide your face and forget our misery and oppression? So when the face of God is hidden, he doesn't see your oppression. He doesn't see your misery. Because it's in out of our misery we call unto God. And he changes our misery into our ministry. So that my misery will become a ministry to minister unto other people. Because everybody in your life is a living witness of what God can do. So that when they go through the same thing and they see you, they will say that yesterday we saw this one and God was able to do it right now. Because hear me right now, I'm sick and tired of you telling me, the God of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob, when are they going to call your name? Have you seen Abraham before? Have you seen Jacob before? But when God does something for you, everybody around you will follow you to your church. Because they will use... They will use your life as a living proof. He says, you forget our misery and our oppression. Let's continue. Let's continue. And it says, and it says, now when he hides from us, we are brought down to the dust. Our bodies cling to the ground. God hides his face from you. Everybody can walk on you. Everybody can stand on you. People are not even up to your level three, two, anyhow. And God hides his face from you. But the moment he begins to shine his face on me, all of a sudden, he says, God, now, rise up and help us. Just because of one thing. Rescue us because of your unfailing love. It means when he hides his face from me and he remembers his love, he comes back to me. Because he will never hide his face from you forever. Today I came to announce to you the love of God. Amen. The love of God is about to be strong in your house. Jesus. About to be strong in your family. Jesus. It's about to be strong everywhere you go. Saw the love of God. The love of God.